Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video is one of my favourite videos to film every single year. This is like my third or fourth year posting this video. Third? No, fourth. It's actually my fourth. I'm sure it is. This is literally my most requested video. I It was literally a trend on TikTok that people were posting like, oh, just waiting for Katie to post her what I got for Christmas video. Um, and I've never been a trend on TikTok. Well, it wasn't really a trend, but like there was quite a few people doing it. So in my head, I'm gonna say it's a trend, but it probably wasn't because like, it wasn't like a popular thing, but um, there was quite a few videos. So I'm just gonna say I was trending on TikTok. I actually love these type of videos. I love watching what people got for Christmas. I don't know why, I'm just so nosy. I'm like, I like what no, not all my friends got for Christmas. I love it so much. It's obviously a bit late into the year. It's not really that late. It's not as late as last year. Last year, it was like the 16th. So I obviously filmed the video of Erin and then I filmed the video of Chloe. And because like I was, I pre-filmed them, so like posting it, it meant I could only post this like now. If you know what I mean? I'm just gonna discuss just gonna put a disclaimer that I'm not bragging in any way this is genuinely just most, my most requested video and I love watching them I'm literally saying what every YouTuber says but it's true like genuinely people request to see it um and if people thought I was bragging everyone hated on it obviously I wouldn't do this video but most people love it so if I, I'm not bragging I'm literally just showing you what I got okay so starting with what my mum and dad got me um first of all I have been using this so it's a bit dirty um but it's the refi makeup product oh i dropped it um it's the refi makeup product so i have been using the brow gel i absolutely love the brow products um so i had to i needed to top up on the gel so i got that and then i got this which is the liquid highlighter which is so nice because i love like a sun kiss kind of makeup look where it's quite natural like a um and then i also asked for the cream contour because it always comes from my Instagram and it looks amazing and I actually really like it. Um, it's like quite natural and creamy and summery, even though it's winter. It makes you feel like summer. So yeah, I love these. I also love the packaging of them. It's like so simple, but nice. So thank you to my mum and dad for that. Honestly, you guys should try these products out. It's really, really good. Okay, the next thing I got, which is gonna sound really, really strange, um, is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. Um, my auntie recommended me this, and it's meant to like um, tighten your skin, and so then people put it on their bum, I think to make your bum bigger, but if I'm being honest, I don't think it actually does that. I just use it as like a normal moisturizer, because it is a normal moisturizer, but I feel like it's known for that. I don't really know. Like, I'm trying to just guess in here. So if you know, let me down in the comments. But it smells unreal. It smells so good. I've been using it every time I get out of the shower. And it's only gone down like that much. Like it actually, a little bit goes a long way. And it smells so fresh. I can't really describe this smell. Like I feel like it smells a bit like, you know, marzipan. But obviously not as strong as marzipan. It has that like kind of tint to it. And then it has like other smells as well. It smells so good, I can't stop smelling it. But you know that trend on TikTok? If you hugged me, this is what I'd smell like, and I'm happy about that because it smells amazing. I then got this next person. If you know me, if you watched my previous videos, you know about the Cloud Perfume. Um, the Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume is the best smelling perfume in the whole entire world, I'm not even joking. Me, Erin, and Holly rave on about this, and in my Christmas gift swap, Holly got it for me. But I, honestly, I've nearly gone like halfway through the bottle because I literally use it every single day. Like, it, honestly, when someone walks in the room with this, like, because I ran out of mine and when Holly and um, Erin came to my house, as soon as they walked in, it's all I could smell and it smells unbelievable. I get so many compliments when I wear this. Um, and it comes in this little, like, cloud holder. Actually insane, so... You honestly like go to a perfume shop and smell it and then trying to resist from not buying it like it's and the price is actually really good i think the i think the 50 mil is like it's like 25 30 quid which is actually really good for a perfume um especially one that smells like this and it's also the dupe of the mason francis i think that's what it's called um but obviously a lot cheaper next i got i have worn this jumper so it probably looks a bit like it's obviously going to look worn. Um, also, my carpet fluff literally sticks to anything black. I don't know why. Like, all my black clothing has the fluff on it. But, obviously, I had to keep it. Because I always keep, like, a pile of, like, my presents um, in my room. So, that I know 
like I don't start using like obviously I use them but like as in I don't put them away because otherwise I'll forget and then I can't do the video um but this is from sisters and seekers it's this black jumper so on the front it literally just says sisters and seekers but then on the back it says it's all good now um, and I actually wore this to the gym with a pair of shorts because 2022 new year new me I'm actually going to the gym who would have thought not me like if you told me a month ago I was actually going to be going to the gym okay but I mean going to the gym I mean like I've gone twice but it's it's progress you know what I mean so and I did have a protein shake believe it or not um, so thanks to my mum and dad for them presents. Right, on this next one you're probably a bit confused because in my video with Chloe I said that the worst friend I worked with was Lounge. I do like their clothing and I said that in the video. Like I genuinely do like their clothing. It was just, it wasn't the clothing, it was just kind of the whole process was a bit back, back and back and forth and obviously it doesn't mean that I hate their brand it just means it is the worst brand of all the brands if you know what I mean because I don't really work with brands unless I like them I don't know if that makes sense but anyways I asked for these pajamas because I saw Imogen Crib wearing these and they're actually insane so they're like this has the little lounge and it says lounge all across and then they're like flares and then at the bottom it's frilly like they're so comfortable and they're not necessarily pajamas I'd wear to bed because I don't really like wearing like long pajamas to bed and stuff but they're kind of you know that kind of day where you don't really go out and you just do like face masks and like pamper routine I'd wear it for that it's like that kind of day which is meant to be my day today but we're going to Penland's for food so I was able to warn them um, and then I got the matching top which is this it's a bit like pulled down but it's like this and yeah it's really cute I've worn it already and I love it. And then I got this set from Bow Avenue. It reminds me of the Primark sets, which I absolutely love. But the good thing is these ones are padded. So it means that I can actually, like, I could probably wear it as a top with tracksuit bottoms. So yeah, and then I got the matching set. I absolutely love this colour. This is, like, one of my favourite colours. Love it. This is actually sick. I mean, I actually broke the top of it. But it's the filter by Molly May, like, the little Christmas cracker in shade dark because i ran out of this and it's actually one of my favorite fake tans because it generally looks very natural and it doesn't really look like fake tan um so i absolutely love this and i love the i honestly just had a little bit of a fright um so i always wear my rings and then if i don't it's when i'm taking it off to go in the shower to wash my face um sorry i ran upstairs so I'm really out of breath this is why i'm going to the gym people and i looked where i normally put them so i down them on my hands right now um and I don't really know where I put them, they weren't there. And then I was worrying a bit because one of these is like my Christmas present, which is why I was thinking about it. And then I ran my mum and she said they're in the girls' bathroom because I bath so in Chloe. So yeah, I was actually really, really shocked when I opened this because I've never ever seen it before. So it's from Dior, which again, look at not again, I don't know why I said again, but look how nice the packaging is. So cute. That'd definitely be going on display. Um and you open it and then this is the little this ring is actually stunning like i actually can't get over it it's so so pretty it's kind of similar to my other one with the fact that it's like this kind of ring but it says dior in all these little diamonds and i'm actually upset ignore my hands right now because i haven't got nails on and i hate my hands so i haven't got nails on and i ain't got fake tan on them so ignore that but yeah i absolutely love it I've, i did exchange it for the sides up because i wear it on my middle finger ignore my hands though they look so disgusting but yeah so thank you so much to my mom and dad for that i actually love it yeah i've been wearing that every day actually one of my favorite rings okay next i actually wanted this tracksuit so badly it's, i put it on my instagram story so you might have already seen it from the named is it named collective yeah um it's this red tracksuit and i've never i had like i've never i don't actually own anything red i just clocked like i actually don't have anything red and i don't really know what came over me i was gonna ask for the pink one but then i was like i do have a lot of pinks so i was like you know what i'll go out there and i'll get red and i actually it's actually one of my favorite tracksuits obviously other than Devu, Devu comes first and um, Devu is genuinely the best tracks i've ever worn but yeah it's like this and then i love the graphics so, yeah and then i got the matching jumper which is just red at the front um but then on the back it has the same picture of the girl all over across the back um i wore it to school and they didn't say anything because i didn't know if they would say anything because obviously but it's just a little bit 
Do you know what I mean? So, but they didn't say anything and I absolutely love it and I'm going to continue wearing it. Um, and then this is my last present. It's also the last present I actually opened and I was so excited when I opened it. Oh my god, I actually, you guys know how much I love my jewellery. And I saw this bracelet in Selfridges when I was shopping with my mum and dad. Um, and I didn't know if to buy it or not, but then I ended up not buying it. Because at, at the time I was saving my money, um, so I didn't buy it. But... I actually am obsessed with this. This is actually one of my favourite things ever. Oh, I'm on the box upside down. It's so, so nice. I have been wearing it, but I literally took it off to put it back in the box. I actually absolutely love it. It's a bracelet, and it's like this. It's like this gold bracelet, but it has like all these little charms on it and that little chain dangles down and is absolutely stunning i've been wearing it every single day um and it just goes with all my jewelry so nicely i absolutely love it so i just want to say a big obviously i said thank you to my mum and dad as well but um thank you so much to my mum and dad for all of them i absolutely love everything i'm really really excited i absolutely love the jewelry it's so funny because when you go through it again, it feels like you're opening it again. Like, you just get the same excitement. I don't know if that makes sense, but, like, after Christmas, I would just go through and, like, just sit. Because I feel like when you're in the moment, you, you're you kind of oblivious. Like, you obviously open everything, but because it's so overwhelming, you kind of forget. And then I always come upstairs and I just, like, go through and <laughs> look for it all. Right, now I'm going to show you what my sister Grace got me. Um, Grace knows how much I love the Zara legging sets, the seamless one. So she got me this top. It's a little blue one. Um, and then the matching leggings, which for some reason are inside out. These blue ones, I actually love the colour. And um, I'm going to wear it with the black jumper. The one that says it's all good now from Sisters and Sleekers. Um, I also feel like I could wear this set to the gym. Like... Although they might be like not the best material because you probably can see if I ever sweat. You can probably see if like, if I did sweat then you'd probably be able to see it. And I love having these leggings when you like pull up Nike socks with Air Forces I, or like Dunks. It looks so nice. So thank you so much Grace for that. Right now from my nan and granddad which is my mum's mum and dad. They got me this alien perfume which again is incredible. This is like the best thing for like nights out. Like if you go out to a party or like for food or something this is like the best perfume for it it's not something you'd wear every day but it's literally one of the best kind of perfumes i love it so much um so thanks my nanny grandma for that and then they also got me this which is actually the cutest thing ever um it's this stocking which also has my name on it um and it is filled with eczema stuff so if you know um i have eczema and everyone always thinks it's a hickey it's quite good now it's like started going um but yeah so i got all this different like eczema creams like so many different things just to try out like this is like eczema cream but it's like soap um and then a spray that's like a, a moisturizer i got a gel i got um this one which is something something cream i don't know what, how to say it shower cream that's e45 got this moisturizing cream so literally this is all for my eczema um so thank you so much my nan and granddad for that i have actually been using some of the stuff i'm trying to like work my way through it because there's a lot to use then obviously you don't use it all at the same time thank you so much my nan and granddad for that i absolutely love it it's actually so cute <laughs> okay and then from my nan and granddad which is my dad's mum and dad what they got me i was so genuinely shocked to open i was not expecting this at all but when i opened the present it was this um this is the box i'm waiting for it to focus balenciaga and this is something that i wanted so badly like i didn't when i wanted obviously i didn't expect it from someone as in i was gonna like buy it myself so i'm so so excited but my nan brought me the balenciaga pink it's literally the exactly same to match my Balenciaga bag and I'm absolutely obsessed. It also because it's pink, it goes with like my black bags. It literally goes with anything pretty much because I don't really have colourful bags. But yeah, as you can see, I've obviously been using it and it's so handy because obviously whenever I go, like wherever I go, like if I change like a small bag or if I go to school, like I literally can just have this with me and it literally fits in my coat pocket. So I always have it with me because I always forget like my cards and stuff. This is the most handy thing and also you don't ever really lose your cards because they're all just in here with you um so there's my gym membership um so thank you thank you thank you so much my nana granda for this i absolutely love it it's so so nice okay and then from my auntie emma which is my mum's sister um ages ago she got me this 
clear bracelet. Oh, I just showed the present. Um, this clear bracelet. It has like the um. I think this was like the Vibrance Crystals or something. I'm not too sure. Um, but it says manifest because we had a conversation about like manifesting and stuff. And I said like how I believed in it. Um, and so this time she got me this bracelet. I think her friend makes it, which is actually sick. These crystals. And then it says dream on it. So it matches the same. Um, so I just kind of switched between the two. But it's so cute. And then she also got me a scratch card for like good luck. Like to see if I was lucky. And I wasn't. But we don't talk about that part, but um, it's really, really thoughtful and I love it. So thank you so much for my Auntie Emma. Love that. And then from my Auntie Lily, which is my mum's sister again, um, it's in my card holder. Bougie. This is actually six. I've never seen something like this. She lives in Hong Kong at the moment for work. So I wasn't able to see her this Christmas, which is actually really, really sad. All my family are with each other every Christmas. This is this gift card, and then it has like all these different shops that you can spend it at. Um, so that's actually sick. I'm gonna probably spend it at John Lewis because I can get like makeup there, and there's this really good product called um, Bobbi Brown, and it's like the primer, and it's really, really good. So I'm gonna get that. And then she also got all me and my sisters a uh, candy floss machine, which is actually sick. Like, it actually makes like proper candy floss like, on the sticks and everything. It's so cool. So thank you to my auntie Lily for that. My dad's sister, my auntie Beth, got me this, which is something I really, really wanted. It's the Marc Jacobs Daisy Love Perfume. It's a huge bottle and also look how pretty it is. Again, this is the one I'm wearing today. It smells on real. It's so good. It's really like a nice, really sweet kind of flavour. That's the kind of perfumes I love. Thank you so much, my auntie Beth. My auntie Beck, again, my dad's um sister she got me all loads of like the olaplex hair products like the shampoo and the conditioner and the hair mask which is in my shower um but she also got me it's basically if you know how olaplex works it's literally like the numbers and then that's the order you use it in so this is the stuff that wasn't in my shower um so i got the bonding treatment which put it in before and then shampoo conditioner obviously hair mask all that stuff and then i got the um oil which i haven't actually used yet because i've got one of the oils which i'm waiting to run out before i use this um and then this is actually the sickest thing because i literally used it today because as you can see i i slick back like my ponytails or like i do a bun sometimes with little spiky bits and this is like a hair gel it's called matte it's called matte pomade um and it's like this and then it means that when you put it in your hair, it slicks it back, but it doesn't go like, it doesn't feel like you have hair gel on it. Like it doesn't go like crispy or uh, anything. So I literally get spoolie, kind of wash it around, wash it around, like literally like scoop a little bit and then just use it to slick back all like the baby hairs and stuff. And then it actually stays in place. So that is actually sick. I've never seen that before. Um, and that's really, really handy. So I've been using that quite a lot. Um, thank you so much for Auntie Beck for that. And then I'm just going to show you what my... So basically I call her grandma, but she's actually my great-grandma, so she's my dad's nan. But I'm just going to show you what she got me because it's actually really, really cute. Because I didn't even, like... I don't know how she thought it's such a good present idea. Like, I never even would have, like, thought about it. But it's such a good present idea. Um, so it's the makeup brush cleaner. So it comes with a little bowl. And then it's actually sick because you have all these little different sizes. And then you put your makeup brush in it, put this at the end, and then it spins round. It spins round, and then you put it, and then you put this, which is the makeup brush cleanser, in here. Get your makeup brush on it. And that's actually sick. I used it the other day. Um, I like started cleaning all like my everyday makeup brushes because I couldn't be bothered to clean all of them. But I use like, yeah, I cleaned all my everyday brushes. But that's actually the sickest thing. So thank you so much to my grandma for that. Um, so that was everything I got for Christmas. Thank you so much to everyone that got me something. And also, I had such a good day spending it with my family. And I hope you guys had a really, really good Christmas. Comment below what your favourite present was. Or like if you got like a funny kind of present, then let me know below because I'm going to sit and read them all. I'm so, so, so grateful for everything and also everyone that wished me a happy Christmas. So thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had a really good Christmas and I'll see you next time. Bye.